name is Teresa. I'm a ballet and a yoga instructor. I am here today to lead you through a stretching routine. You can use the stretching routine before workout, after workout, before bed, after you wake up in the morning. Stretching is really good for your muscles. It's good for your circulation. Um, so let's get started. Place the soles of your feet together. Try not to grab onto your toes, but rather maybe grab onto your ankles. You can start to flap your knees wide. Take a deep breath in and exhale as you lower all the way down to your toes. Try not to dive down, but rather sit, sit tall, grow your spine, reach up and over your toes for a nice deep stretch here. Stay here for a few breaths. Work your way back up again, straight spine as you come back up. And flap your knees a few more times. Walk your right fingertips out to the side, bend your right elbow and reach up and over your head with your left arm. Try not to collapse into the side body here. You want a nice deep stretch, a nice long stretch here along your left side. And back through center, walk your left fingertips out, bend your left elbow, and reach up and over to the left side with your right arm. You should feel a nice side stretch here from your hip all the way up through your fingertips. And back to center. This time we're going to bring our heels in closer to our body. And we're gonna do a nice hip opener. So walk your fingertips down to the ground. Your knees should open wide here. Do as much as you can. You don't want to injure yourself. So if you feel pain, stop immediately and go back where it's comfortable. Breathe here. Very nice. Walk it back in. And let's do a straight legged stretch. So I'm just gonna turn so you can see my legs long. Point your toes, reach your arms up, straight spine here. You don't wanna have a curved spine. You also don't wanna be overextended where your belly is protruding. You wanna keep a nice straight spine here. Arms are lifted above your head. Toes are pointed, legs are nice straight, long line. Inhale and exhale, reach down to your toes. Of course, it's not expected to always reach your toes sometimes. This is a good stretch and that's fine. Maybe try and reach your ankles next time and then maybe eventually you'll be able to reach your toes. But like I said, it's not expected, it's not important. Just stretch where you are comfortable. Straight spine and then exhale. Coming back up, stay in this position, but this time flex your feet so your toes are reaching towards the ceiling. If there was a wall in front of you, it would be like you're standing on that wall. So you want your feet to be super flexed here. This time reach your arms out to the side and then hug your feet in. You will feel this stretch in the back of your legs, specifically your calf muscles. And straight spine, inhale and exhale. And reach back up. Keep your right leg here. We're going to bend our left leg, left knee in to the center. Right leg is, is long, pointed toes. Reach your arms out, curve your right arm under, and reach your left arm up and over towards your right toes, right ear to your right knee. Again, not expected to reach, but just try your best. Try not to lift your left sits bones off of the ground. Make yourself nice and grounded here. And come back up. Both legs long this time. And reach over to the right. Same arm position. Toes are pointed, legs are straight and long. And back up. Bend your right knee. Now we're doing the opposite side. 
So curve your left arm under, right arm over, and left ear to left knee. Again, just like in the beginning, you want a nice side stretch here. Remember to breathe. And back through center. Come back through that straddle and reach down to the left side. And back to center. Come back to an easy seat. And that was your stretching session. Check back later for a session on how to improve your splits. Thank you.